二月二十五日上午十点三十分，加州众议员伍国庆在他的新签办公室召开了记者招待会，并于当天公布了他二零一一年的最新立法计划。吴国庆表示，今年将是他众议员的最后一任，他将继续巩固他在前几年所取得的成功及经验。吴国庆强调，他的计划是积极推动他的立法议程，针对他所代表的选区以及加州所面临的困难的真正解决方案。在他所支持的十五个法案中，有以下四个措施代表了吴国庆众议员这些年来所积极努力的领域，包括成人教育经费、公共安全、亚裔社区数据分类统计和针灸。吴国庆表示。是成人教育与筹资议会幺八九法案要求资助的学生至少需要花费百分之六十五的资金，帮助成人学生取得高中文凭及读写能力，并且通过职业技术训练课程掌握必要的技能教育。至于公共安全第幺六幺项法案，将帮助企业及执法部门维护及保障个人财产安全和禁止有前科之人士再次擅自闯入该人曾经犯罪之地。关于亚裔社区数据分。类第幺零八八项法案将确保由州政府所收集的关于保健、社会服务、劳工、教育、公民权利的数据，在亚裔族裔社区当中也能够得到进一步的分类，并且将这些信息公开。针灸行医第七十二项法案将让民众获得更多的卫生保健，包括针灸医疗保险计划。Like children、um, from bullying to make sure that we have more health care for people that want to use acupuncture. To protect small businesses from people that come and do shoplifting repeatedly, to protect adults that don't speak English, and make sure that they can learn English、uh, through our adult education program. Many years ago,、um, many people had never heard of acupuncture, but now, if you have, you know, a, a neck pain or shoulder pain or back pain, that's sometimes the first thing people think of is acupuncture. But unfortunately, acupuncture is not covered in many health plans. So, we're saying that in California, if you have a health plan,、um, you should be covered with acupuncture.、And、this will make it easier for everyone to use acupuncture. We think that it's not a mysterious medicine from Asia anymore. It's something that many Californians and many Americans now see as mainstream as any other medical. Device, so we just want to make it easier for all of California to use acupuncture.、Uh, right now, California sometimes contracts out for up to forty billion dollars in jobs that can be performed by state workers, and with very very little money for the budget, we're saying that if you contract out, if the state agency hires someone else to do the same job that you have, then you have to put it on the website so we can find out. Why we're wasting that money? So that's our government transparency bill. It, we've done it three times, and the governor's always vetoed it. So I'm hoping this this year he will sign that bill. The that was my transparency bill. We are also doing a bill on trespassing to protect small businesses. As many of you know, in the Asian and minority communities,、um, we don't make much money, and so if someone comes and steals some candy here, steals a T-shirt there. And they come, you know, every day. Someone steals something. By the end of the day, we have no money to feed our families. So this bill says that if you've been convicted of the crime once, then you can't come back、uh, for several years to make it easier for the small business. Particularly in my area, small business is so important. The restaurants,、um, the,、uh, the, you know, the, the stores, the flower shops—they all are very, very important to our local economy.